there's basically five different classifications of fires. Class A's, Class B's, Class C's, Class D's, and Class K's. Each one of those fires might be involved with another class altogether. And that's why we have fire extinguishers that are classified for multiple types or multiple classes of fires. Class A fires, we talk about those, are the normal wood combustible and paper products. We talk about Class B fires, those are petroleum or fluid-based products that are burning. Class C fire is an electrical fueled fire, which means that it's something that is an electric ignition source that has gotten hot and the insulation or things around the electricity itself have gotten hot and started to combust. When we talk about Class D fires, those fires are the metals, which would be our sodiums, and other metals that can burn when they get to a heat source. Class K fires are those fryers, uh, turkey fryers, things of that nature that we experience around our houses, and those require a special extinguisher to help put those out. That special extinguisher, a type K extinguisher, uses saponification to put that out where it actually converts the oil into a salt and soap, that way it's no longer burnable. Many people don't have extinguishers in their own homes, and it's important to make sure we get the right size extinguisher. When we look at sizing an extinguisher, it can be, be identified right here on the label. This is a 3A or a 40BC. 3A stands for how much fire that it can put out in its water sense. And we know that it is one and a quarter times the actual rating for the amount of water that can be placed or the equivalent of water on a fire. The next rating that we see is a 40 BC. 40 stands for 40 square feet of liquid flat on the ground that it could put out if it was burning. So when we think in terms of that, it would be a four by 10 area that would be completely on fire with a petroleum product. The C we don't give a rating to because carbon dioxide extinguishers and used in electrical fires are hard to judge in size. Thanks for watching this prep clip. You can learn more at indianaprepared.org or on our YouTube channel.